What's going on, Elite Fam? This is Tyler Green Regiment. Welcome for another day. Crazy day, of course. This is day 18 specifically. The name of this workout is called Pandemic Pump. You know, it's funny because this workout kills a lot of you out there. I mean, at least I get a lot of DMs talking about that. And the reason why is because these slow controlled movements are just so taxing on your muscles. Sometimes when you do a lot of cardio movements, you can cheat a little bit. But when it comes to these like incredibly intense and long drawn out muscle control movements, your body is just like all your muscle fibers are twitching. And that's what causes this, these, some of these exercises to be a little bit more difficult, but that's exactly what you need. So for today's first exercise, pandemic pump. Now just of course, as you remember, every single exercise is gonna be 25 reps and it's all about the tempo here and everything's on a three count. So for the wide chest, we're gonna come out, plank position, but our hands are gonna be nice and wide. And we're gonna go down and control it on a three count. Two, three, tap the ground. Two, three. And breathe out on the way up. One, two, three. One, two, three. Let's just do it again because I love it so much. Two, three, up. One, two, three. The entire time. My stomach is nice and tight. I'm focused on my pecs. That's what it's all about. Pandemic pump. Next exercise. Time for some tricep dips. Now, what's funny is that this exercise, I think I've only received about 10 or 12 videos of people showing me how they do their tricep extensions because this is tough. I understand. But remember, there's a way to make them easier, but we're going to start with the more difficult way. So we want to keep that stomach nice and tight. And want to come down on a three count. Two, three, up. One, two, three. Extend at the top. The easier adjustment is just bring the heels in. One, two, three, down. One, two, three. And of course, the easiest way to do them is you can move the chair out the way, right on the ground. So I do want to see some videos of you, of you attempting these because a lot of you have weak triceps out there and the reason why is because you're not hitting the triceps. Just like that. That simple. All right, next, 25 closed grip push-ups. This is another exercise that just totally kills you out there, but it's okay. That's why we're doing these workouts, to get you nice and strong for you to be able to do them. We're coming down on a three count. Up, one, two, three. Remember, our thumbs are roughly six to eight inches apart from each other. And we're coming down using our triceps and then coming up, two, three. And of course, you can do these on your knees for the modification. And we're coming down the same way. Tap your hands, up. Two, three, one more. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now it's time for some split squats. Now I know the split squat is a little bit difficult because you're working on your balance here and these are extremely taxing. So of course, we wanna make sure all of our strength is coming down on our heel and coming off our heel. And we're going down on that three count and coming up, two, three. I know you're gonna start shaking. I know you already have been shaking as you do this, but that's okay. I just want you to get through it, that's all. 25 reps. You have the time now, we're quarantined. It's just what it is, right? So we have the time. This is the best time for you to be able to focus on these workouts, so let's make it happen. Then we're simply just gonna switch legs after we do 25. 25 with the next leg. Two, three. One, two, three. Watch my tempo again. One, two, three, down, one, two, three. Leg lifts, 25 slow and controlled leg lifts. Make sure those hands are right beneath your lower back. We're gonna start with the heels, six to eight inches off the ground. And we're gonna come up about midway on that three count, then come down, two, three. Up immediately, one, two, three, down, one, two, three. 25 slow and controlled scissor crossover kicks. Same position as the leg lifts, except we're gonna cross over. You know this, you've been doing this for a few weeks now. Nice and slow and controlled. That's the tempo, that's what I wanna see. 25 reps. I don't care how long it takes you, just get them done. 25 ab roll-ups. 
you know how to do these as well, make sure those hands are nice and flat to support you as you come up. Tap the ground, put your back, and then come up. Just like that, nice tempo. And of course, if you don't need your hands, then don't use them. 25 reps of oblique ankle taps, and we're gonna alternate one, one, two, two. Now we want that chin nice and high. So those obliques for the abs as well are flexed the entire time. And we want to touch in front of our ankle this time. Let's make it a little bit more difficult. Touch in front of our ankles. So we really work that oblique. There it is. Day number 18 finished. Now I know yesterday was tough. Today was tough. And tomorrow is going to be tough as well. So that's why you need to make sure that you're stretching, you're eating well. Think about this, okay? Day number 18. When I started this series, day number one, who would have thought that we'd still be in it day number 18? We had no idea. And we don't know how long we're going to be in this. But I'll tell you this. This is the time for you to focus on your health and nutrition now. While we are confined in our homes, this is the time. Because once we're out and we're free, who knows how things are going to be. I actually kind of do know what's going to happen. We're going to go back to our regular routines. And then we get into that same cycle of wishing that we had been focused and committed while we had the opportunity. So seize the opportunity. Make sure you pass these videos on to your friends and family. They need them just as much as you do. That's it. There we go. I'll see you for day 19.